Hey Jetty Rockers, welcome to Jetty Rocks Fishing and I'm Mike D. Well today we're going to do another segment of the cleaning table. And today we're going to be cleaning a very strange looking fish, but a cool fish nonetheless. And it's actually a very tasty fish. We're going to be cleaning a sea robin. So I'll see you guys at the cleaning table. <music> sea robin here these are a really cool looking fish i mean yeah really cool they're in the gnard family they're really cool fish and they're very misunderstood fish and they're very often overlooked fish but this is one of the best tasting fish that there is and i am not even kidding you and i'm not the only one that thinks so anybody that has tried this fish has absolutely loved it very easy fish to clean you just make an incision behind the head turn your knife sideways just go along that backbone. You do get quite a bit of meat off a little bit of a small fish, but they do get much bigger than this. We usually, when they're in, we can catch them anywhere from a pound to a pound and a half, which is a pretty decent sized sea robin. And I was really hoping today we'd catch a little bit more because these really are good fish. So there you go, pretty easy. But as you can see, they get really nice white meat. They're very flaky when cooked. They are not bony. Just a little bit of bones right here. Just like any other fish. And there you go. There's a nice little fillet. Granted, I only got one, so there's not a whole lot. So I'm going to cook this with the rest of the fish that I cooked today. The rest of the fish that I caught today, rather. And we'll just do a little taste test between the sea robin and maybe the whiting and pompano. Or I'll just do the sea robin all by itself. We don't know yet what we're going to do. But there you go, guys. There's your little sea robin fillets. And I kid you not, this stuff is outstanding. Just a cool little fact about the sea robin. They got these little feet that they walk around the bottom. They feel around to find their food. Cool little thing. You know, and they got these big wings on them. And their head is loaded with these spikes. And they're really hard. And if you're not careful when you're handling them, they will get you. They got them right here along their gills, along the top of their head. All along over there by their eyes they will get you if you're not careful hey guys well I hope you all enjoyed that video just a real quick video me cleaning the sea robin and i hope you guys have ever catch one you give it a try and now you have a video to show you how to clean one i appreciate each and every one of you all for watching this video and i appreciate every one of you guys for subscribing to my channel if you haven't subscribed please go ahead and hit that subscribe button y'all until i get to see you again on the water here soon Hey, Rockers, thank you very much for watching this video. I'd like to invite you all to go follow me on my Facebook page at Jetty Rocks Fishing and also my Instagram page. I also have a JRF apparel page which will send you a link to my Teespring page where I have some cool shirts and some mugs. I appreciate you guys very much. Or check out the description in the bottom of this video. I'll have the links. Tight lines, Jetty Rockers.